the Sun is one of the most vital resources for our planet Earth. Why not we use solar energy to power our offices and our homes? Currently, it is a challenge to make solar energy economical. This is because when we harvest solar energy, we need a place to store it. A common way to store it now is in batteries, which can be bulky and non-biodegradable. So why not use cold air in the form of liquid air? Liquid air basically is air, which is abundant. It is also a very safe solution as it is just air. And the great thing about it is, it can cool rooms down. This saves costs of using air cons. Now, for our product, how does Sol Air work? First, air that contains water, carbon dioxide, and dust is sucked into our system where it is brought through a dust filter. Dust is then filtered out from the air. The air, in the next stage of filtration, goes through the condenser which is powered by cold air at negative 196 degrees Celsius. This is where water and carbon dioxide are filtered from the air. Ice and dry ice will be formed during this process. The air then goes through a compressor which compresses it to 60 atm. The hot air will then enter the heat exchanger where hot air exchanges heat with cold air. The air is then passed through a Jules Thompson's valve where they will be liquefied. Air that has been liquefied will then be channeled into the dual storage, which can be kept for an indefinite amount of time until it is needed again. A dual is strong, durable, and small in size to save space. Perfect for our liquid air. When energy is needed, the liquid air will then be channeled into an expansion chamber where it exchanges heat with the hot water which flows through a pipe. This hot water comes from pipes that run alongside the solar panels that are hot from the exposure of the sun. Heat that enters the liquid causes the liquid air to expand into gas. The gas then enters the turbine which turns the fan blades to produce mechanical work. This mechanical work then generates electricity. The strong cold air is then passed through vents, which is then channeled through the whole building which cools out our rooms. Waste cold air will then enter the room and absorb its heat. A fan installed to circulate the air in the room will eventually cool the room down. After that, the cold air is then reused in the condenser and filtration stages. Or it goes back to the compressor and repeats the cycle. So, what are the environmental benefits of using soul air? Through soul air, we envision a greener world. With no pollution and a better future. Soul air, revolutionizing energy storage.